Okay, this is what you need to know about the new Trello changes in 90 seconds. Let's go. First of all, the new change is that Trello is only allowing 10 people, 10 collaborators, members in your free Trello workspace. A collaborator is a workspace member, someone on your board. That's what it means. We'll have a link where you can go see exactly how many collaborators you have. Um, next, the timeline. It's April 8th. What happens on April 8th, Mike? On April 8th, you can't add any new collaborators if you're over the 10 collaborator limit. But nothing else happens. Your boards don't get frozen. Your work states don't get frozen. It just carries on working. You just can't add new people. And then following on, May the 20th is the date where they cut this in. And you can, from that point, your boards will be frozen if you're over the 10 collaborator limit. Yes. And just to call out, you're not losing any data. They're not, like, gone frozen. They're just read only. So you can still see what you need in there. You just won't be able to edit until you upgrade or get under the limit. So let's talk about real quick what you can do to prepare. One, a 30-day premium trial is coming in April. Use it. It's going to help you extend this timeline, be able to sort out what you need to do with it. Make sure to do that. Go, go into your workspace. Use the 30-day trial. Go into your workspace and look at the boards you've got and look at the members on them and see how many boards you can get down to having people with single board guests because single board guests are completely free. If you're worried about having too many people in one board and it feeling cluttered, make sure you're utilizing filters. Make sure if you've got a team in a board and you have other people having their own individual boards, they don't need that. You can use filters to just cards that are assigned to you. We have a longer version of this. This was the speed round. Um, I'm going to include a link to the longer version where we go into all more of this, our thoughts and feelings and everything, and uh, show you more about how you can do this. In the meantime, follow me and Mike on LinkedIn. Join the Atlassian community. Head over there. Ask your questions. There's lots of people who are asking similar questions to you and lots of people responding. And we will see you over there.